Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to tonight's RTC TV4 coverage where the Lady Comets are hosting the Winnemac Lady Warriors here on the hardwood. I'm Blair Zimmerman, and I will be commentating tonight's event. Looking forward to some great basketball this evening. I will tell you guys that just before this matchup, the JV Comets did fall to the JV Warriors, uh, and we'll have to see. Uh, we'll have to see how the evening goes. John Harrell is predicting a Warriors victory this evening, so we'll have to uh, we'll have to just see how everything plays out. Right, and for some starting lineups, two, we have number two, Aubrey Gearhart. Number three, Kinsley Croft. Number, three, Kinsley Croft. number four, Alyssa Villanueva. Number five, Maggie Smith. And number ten, Ella Gearhart. Now for your Lady Comets. Number 11, freshman Isabel Scales. Number 12, Bailey Harness. Number 13, Addison Zimpleman. Number 14, Kinsey Mollenkoff. And number 35, senior Jordan Klingler. Smith and Klingler facing off in the center circle. There's a jump. And Winnemac takes first possession with a quick steal by Izzy Scales. Scales up at the center ring. Picks up her dribble over on the left side, passes it to Zimpleman. Over to Molenkoff on the right. Lady Comets still keeping the ball outside the arc.
Zippelman drives inside, passes over to the right to Scales. Top of the key to Molenkoff. Back outside. Harness in the paint, back out to Scales. Scales for three, and it's good. Scales drawing uh, first blood here against these Lady Warriors. Croft brings the ball down court, passes off to Gearhart. Gearhart to the elbow to Croft. Croft for the layup. No good, but she will draw the foul. She'll go to the line for two. Foul called on number 35, Jordan Klingler. Her first, team first, and that dubious honor of game first. First shot is good. Second shot, also good. Scales will bring the ball down the floor for the Comets. Cross that timeline. We're over to Zimpleman. Zimpleman to the top of the key to Molenkoff. Back to Zimpleman. Dribble baseline back up to the top of the key. Ball still outside of the arc. It's a Winamag zone proving difficult to get inside of. Molenkoff for a long two and it's good. Harness putting on some pressure, and she will foul Kingsley Croft. Her first, team second. Ball into the backcourt to Croft. She'll pass it to Gearhart. Gearhart to Gearhart. <laughs> Three-pointer by Croft is off the mark. Over the back foul on the shot. Fouls on number 12, Bailey Harness, her second. Aubrey Gearhart at the line for the and one attempt. Off the mark. Comet's getting that rebound. Ball into Isabel Scales. She'll cross center court. Over to Molenkoff at the volleyball line. Molenkoff to Lane Oliver who's come in and picked off by the Warriors. Kingsley Croft quick across the line. We're sending it over to Gearhart, who drives baseline. She's trapped by three comments. Over to an open Maggie Smith. Two-point attempt off the mark. Pair of turnovers there, leaves the ball in. Warriors possession, where we're turned over off of travel. Scales bringing the ball across midcourt. She'll dribble outside to the right. Long two by Molenkoff is too long. Klingler with the rebound. Gets fouled on the shot attempt. Foul is on number five. Maggie Smith, that's her first, team first. Klingler at the line for two. First shot is good. Klingler getting to the hard way. 
Warriors now. Kingsley Croft bringing it across midcourt. Passes off to Aubrey Gearhart. Ball gets swatted away by Lane Oliver. Can't quite get to it before it goes out of bounds. Lady Warriors keep possession here. Ball into Smith. Over to Villanueva. Underneath, shot attempt by Kingsley Croft. Swatted away. Lady Comets getting that rebound. And Isabel Smith loses control of the ball on her drive. She'll give it back to the Lady Warriors. Aubrey Gearhart coming across center ring. Lane Oliver sticking tight. Down to the post to Gearhart for two. Scales at the volleyball line. Backing up to the middle ring. She'll send it over to Molenkoff on the right. Molenkoff to Zempelman. Back up at the volleyball line. Over to Oliver. Scales from the elbow. Shot no good, but she'll go to the line for two. Fouls on number two, Aubrey Gearhart. Her first, team second. Gale's first shot just a little off the mark. And the Warriors will send in number 14, Kaya Campbell. Giving Aubrey Gearhart a break. Second shot a little off the mark. And nearly gets her own rebound. Can't quite. Lady Warriors end up with that uh, save as it goes out of bounds. Campbell to Croft, Croft to Smith. Ball picked off by uh, Scale or excuse me, Zimpleman. She goes hard to the basket, draws the foul, and makes the bucket. Foul on number five, Maggie Smith. Her second, team third. Zimpleman at the line for the and one attempt. Just slightly off the mark. Oliver nearly going over the back. And we have a timeout called by the Lady Warriors. Just under half of the first quarter left to go here. Casting Comets with a three point lead over Winnemac. You are watching Lady Comets, Lady Warriors basketball here on RTC TV4. Ball in play to Kingsley Croft. She'll send it over to Gearhart. Gearhart bobbling that ball, manages to pass it off to Aubrey Gearhart. Going underneath to Ella Gearhart, who gets blocked there. Lady Comets with that rebound. And they'll travel at the other end of the floor and give it back. I have to say, Lady Comets last night really struggling with the rebounds. And they, uh, imagine they had some practice today and, and worked on that. And they are doing a much better job with rebounds here tonight. Got a push in the back. It's going to look like on number 14, Kinsey Molenkoff. That'll be her first, team fourth. Ella Gearhart with the ball out of bounds. Sends it to Aubrey Gearhart. Gearhart puts it underneath. 
shot by Villanueva up at the elbow. No good, but the Warriors do get their own rebound. Passed up to Kingsley Croft. Croft sends it inside to Gearhart. Gearhart from the paint, and it's good. Winnemag bringing this back to a one-point ball game. Mollenkoff over on the right. We'll send it down to the post. Klingler for two. Kingsley Croft quick down to the Warriors into the court. Over to Villanueva. Gearhart, long two, and it's good. Zumpelman on the right comes across the top of the key. Over to Molenkoff. Molenkoff is going to send it to Scale. Scale's in and out. Long three, and it's good. Scale's two for two from downtown. Croft across midcourt. Over to Gearhart. Mollenkoff, very aggressive there, trying to swipe that ball away. It's no good. And looks like we've got a foul caught on Lane Oliver. Maybe not. Scratch that. That is a foul on Ella Gearhart. That'll be her first, team fourth. Scales into Mollenkoff. Back to Scales, who will bring it across the center court. Over to Mollenkoff on the left. Zumpelman, top of the key, back to Mollenkoff. Lady Commons moving the ball very well, looking to get inside. Scales with the jumper from the free throw line, no good. And foul there on Lane Oliver on that rebound attempt. Her first, team fifth. Seventy-five seconds on the clock for the first quarter. Zumpelman, tight press there as Campbell brings it across midcourt. Campbell will dish off to Croft. Croft inside to Gearhart. Gearhart in double coverage back outside to Croft. Lady Warriors moving the ball around now. Very aggressive defense, and the ball go out of bounds off of the Warriors. Forty-eight seconds left to play here in the first. My guess would be the Lady Comets will try to run the clock a little bit and get the final shot attempt here in the first quarter. Or Zimpleman will go for three, a little off the mark. Monkoff with the rebound. Put back, no good. Two pointer for Aubrey Gearhart is good. 18 seconds left in the quarter. 13 now. Down under 10. Scales drives to the right. Back up to Zimpleman. Four seconds now. Mollenkoff from the free throw line, it's good, and that'll be the end of the first here. At the end of one, Caston 16, Winnemac 12. You are watching Comets Warriors basketball here on RTC TV4.
Lady Warriors will take the ball out to start two. Zumbleman already setting up a pretty tight defense there on Campbell. Campbell back across the timeline. That was a rough pass. It could have been capitalized on. Uh, Croft got there in time, picked it up. Campbell looking for some help. She dishes off to Aubrey Gearhart. Nice swat there by, uh, by Oliver. Goes out of bounds, but that'll stop the uh, head of steam that the Warriors were trying to build. Good defense here by the Comets. Ball into Gearhart. Back over to Croft. Croft sends it to Aubrey Gearhart. Top of the key to Campbell. Campbell for three. Off the mark, and Klingler with that rebound. And the Warriors will tie it up. Go to jump ball. Scales now bringing it across midcourt. No pressure being put on by the Warriors yet tonight. Hand off to Zimpleman. To Molenkoff. Molenkoff around the top of the arc. Passes to Klingler back to Zimpleman. Zimpleman with the head fake. Up to the center ring to Scales. Scales drives around to the right. She picks it up outside the three-point line. A little off the mark. Warriors with that rebound. Ball across to Villanueva. She'll drive baseline and out of bounds. Minute and a half gone here in the second. Still scoreless in the second, both teams. And we've got a jump ball situation. Arrow takes it back to Winnemac. Gearhart sends it into Campbell. Campbell in awaiting me, uh, Zimpleman. And pass picked off by Scales. She goes down and puts it in for two. Fast break by Croft. Picks it up. Oh, we got a push by Jordan Klingler, I believe, under the basket. Scratch that. That's Kenzie Molenkoff, her second, team sixth. We'll send Emma K in. Molenkoff will take a break. got to say, uh, Emma K had a couple of fantastic moments there at the end of the JV game. So she's had a, a quarter here to take a break. See how she does here on the varsity floor. Three-pointer by Croft. Off the money. Klingler with that rebound. Sends it over to Zimpleman. Zimpleman to scales at the middle ring. To Emma K. Emma K down to the post to Klingler. Klingler no good, and uh, she'll wrap up that rebound, jump ball. Lady Comets will keep it. Official asking for a comment out of bounds. Zimpleman looking for the inbound, sends it to Oliver. Oliver in the paint. She'll draw the foul on the shot attempt. She'll go to the line for two. Foul there on number three, Kingsley Croft. Her first, team fifth. First shot just a little off the mark. Second shot up and off the mark. Rebound 
by the Warriors. Warriors lose it. Lady Comets keep possession in their territory. Ball into Zimpleman. Zimpleman back to Oliver. Scales at the volleyball line. Back to Oliver and Zimpleman on the left. Cross court to K over to Scales. Ball staying outside the three point arc. Up to the top of the key to Zimpleman. Back to Scales. Cross court to K. K for three. Just off the front of the rim. Warriors with that rebound. Croft underneath to Gearhart. Gearhart for two. It's no good. Lady Comets rebound. K with an open three point look, and it's good. Home crowd's getting pretty excited here. Comets have gone five points with no answer from the Warriors. Gearhart at the volleyball line. She'll drive across to the left, sends it into the paint, nearly picked off by Oliver. Villanueva ends up putting it in for two. Half of the second gone here. 21-14, Comets advantage. Scales at the center ring. Passes out to Emma Kay. She sends it into Lane Oliver in the paint, and the ball bounces in. Croft across midcourt. And she'll get called with a charge as she sends Scales flying. That's her first. Team sixth. And Coach Douglas will call a timeout. 351 left to play in the half. Caston 23, Winnemac 14. You're watching Comets Warriors basketball here on RTC TV4. And we're back after that timeout. Addison Zimpleman to send the ball in to Isabel Scales. Scales now. Cross midcourt. At the volleyball line, she'll dribble right. Sends it to Zimpleman in the right corner. Zimpleman picks it up and puts it in for two. Croft quick across the timeline. Passes off to Campbell. Campbell in double coverage. And we got a push here, I believe on Emma K. Yes, <laughs> push on Emma K. That's her first, team seven. We'll send Campbell to the line for one and one. First shot up and good. Lady Warriors yet to miss from the free throw line tonight. And KO will continue that trend.
25-16, Comets ball game so far. Scales drives to the right. Sends it up top of the key to Zimpleman. Kind of a wild pass. Emma K with a contested three. It's a little short. And Lady Warriors will get that rebound. Kaya Campbell bringing the ball across midcourt. Over to Villanueva, or excuse me, Maggie Smith. Kingsley Croft now. Back to Campbell. Campbell to Smith. Smith to Campbell. Over to Croft. Back to Campbell. Up at the volleyball line. Fakes the pass. Sends it to Smith. Foul called here on Kingsley Croft. Her second, team seventh. Scales bringing the ball down the floor. Across the timeline. Sends it over to Emma Kay. K to the corner to Zimpleman. Back to K over to Scales. Scales for three, and it's good. Ball into Aubrey Gearhart now. Gearhart across midcourt. She's going to send it over to Ella Gearhart. And pass picked off by Zimpleman. Zimpleman goes coast to coast. Shot no good. Rebound, Warriors. Campbell bringing the ball back into Warriors territory. Over to Aubrey Gearhart. Gearhart to Smith. Smith for a long two that's good. Comets now with a 10 point lead. And Scales will bring it into Comets territory. At the volleyball line, she'll pass over to Kay. Kay with a fairly open three. Off the mark. Comets rebound. Three-point attempt by Zimpleman off the mark. Campbell going to pick it up at the elbow. Shot no good. Jump ball. Possession Winamac. Seventy-one seconds remain in the half. Ball in deep to Villanueva. Nearly picking off the pass there. And Scales ties it up for a jump ball. Possession will go to the Comets. Sixty-three seconds left in the half now. Scales bringing the ball into Comets territory. That center ring, volleyball line, she's gonna drive in. Dishes over Zimpleman. Zimpleman with an oh, with a three from the left. It's no good. Ball sent out of bounds. And the Warriors will take possession with 49 seconds left in the half. Campbell, cross midcourt. Over to Gearhart. It's Ella Gearhart. She'll send it to Aubrey Gearhart. Tight coverage there provided by Addison Zimpleman. Ball goes back to Campbell. She'll drive towards the paint, dish it out to Smith. Pass swatted away by Zimpleman. Knocks it out of bounds. 18 and a half seconds left in the half. Smith puts it into Campbell. 12 seconds to play in the half. Under 10 now. Campbell into the paint. Foul called, I believe, on Lane Oliver. She'll send Campbell to the line for two. 
Scratch that. Foul there on number 33, Emma K. Her second. Team eighth. Campbell at the line for two. It's her opportunity to bring it to less than a double digit game. She does that. Second shot up. It's off the mark. Comets rebound. Four seconds left to play. Klingler not quite getting that buzzer beater off. At the end of the first half, Kasten 28, Winnemac 19. We'll be back for second half action here in 10 minutes. We're going to step away for a few words from our sponsors, and I'll be back with some uh, halftime stats. You're watching Comets and Warriors basketball here on RTC T Lady Warriors will start the second half with possession. Smith into Croft. Croft down to the post. The ball is picked off and we will start the second half here with the jump ball. Possession arrow to the Comets. Scales bring the ball across the timeline. She goes right, sends it up the top of the key to Smith or uh, Zimpleman, nearly picked off by Croft. Harness into the paint. And ball picked off here. We're going to have a foul, I believe, on Izzy Scales as she tries to swat the ball away and get it back. Scratch that. That is Zimpleman. Her first, team first in the half. Smith looking for somebody to send the ball to. And that'll be Aubrey Gearhart. Gearhart quick across midcourt. Zumpelman all up in her face. Ball over to Ella Gearhart. Back to Aubrey Gearhart. On the right, sends it to the top of the key to Croft. Tight defense being played by the Comets here tonight. Smith over to Ella Gearhart. Kingsley Croft at the top of the key. Croft bobbing in and out over on the right-hand side, swatted out of bounds by the Comets. Ball into Ella Gearhart. Gearhart to Croft. Croft for two. Off the bottom of the rim. Comets with that rebound. Villanueva putting some pressure on Izzy Scales. Zimpleman pass to uh, Bailey Harness. She, back to Zimpleman, she goes baseline, puts it in for two. Long pass, picked off. Picked off there by Lane Oliver. Sends it to scale, scales across the volleyball line. Stops just inside the three point. Over to Bailey Harness. Harness drives inside the arc, and passes picked off. Croft lowers his shoulder. Foul going to be called, though, against Lane Oliver. We'll send Kingsley Croft to the line for two. That's Oliver's second. Team second in the half. First shot good for Croft. Second shot off the back of the rim. Warriors rebound. Gearhart for two, and it's good. 
Gearhart three for three here tonight. Oliver attempts to pass into the paint. Pass is picked off. Gearhart to Smith. Smith wide open at the elbow. No good. Gearhart with that rebound. And we'll have a jump ball. Possession to the Warriors. They'll reset and try again. Come out of the locker room. Very aggressive on those rebounds. Aubrey with two. No good. Another jump ball. Comments will get this one. Zimpleman now across midcourt. She's set up at this volleyball line looking for her play. She'll go left, she'll go right. She loses the dribble, manages to get the ball back over to Harness. Harness for three. A little too hard. Rebound Warriors. Croft across midcourt. Passes it directly to Jordan Klingler. Not quite halfway done with the third quarter here. Pass in to Klingler, out to Zimpleman. Zimpleman for three. A little too hard. Harness gets that rebound. Klingler puts it in for two. Shot no good, Comets rebound. Three-pointer for Scales is off the mark. Smith from the elbow, no good. Rebound swatted away. And Mollenkoff and Campbell back in for their respective teams. Gearhart looking for the inbound. Sends it back deep to Campbell. Campbell at the center ring now. Back to Smith. Smith with that left elbow again. Over to Villanueva, shot off the mark. Common rebound. And Harness puts it in for two. Timeout, Winamac. Going into this timeout, Comets have pulled ahead to a 12-point advantage. 3.20 left to play here in the third. You're watching Comets Warriors basketball here on RTC TV4. Ladies retaking the floor after that timeout. Ball in to Campbell. Campbell breaks towards the right, and she'll travel. Mollenkoff will bring the ball down the floor for the Comets. 
Top of the key, looking for a pass. Sends it to Zimpleman, back at the volleyball line. Zimpleman getting tripped up a little bit there, passes it to Molenkoff. Molenkoff to Klingler at the elbow. Klingler for two, off the mark, and we'll have a reach over foul. Foul called against number five, Maggie Smith. That'll be her third, team first in the half. Monkoff sends it in to Zimpleman. Up to Harness at the top of the key. Scales on the left. Back to Zimpleman on the right. Molenkoff, she'll go into the paint. Sends it down to the post. Klingler shot a little off the mark. Warriors get that rebound. Campbell over to Aubrey. Uh, Gearhart, Gearhart for two. About said Aubrey Degg. Uh, she played for the Comets, and that was last season. Scales now into the Comet territory. Harness will drive baseline, gets her shot swatted. Warriors get that rebound. Campbell over to Smith. Smith to Aubrey Gearhart. Gearhart from the paint. Shot no good. Comets rebound. Long pass to Klingler. To Harness. Harness goes for two and draws a foul. Foul on number five, Maggie Smith. Her fourth. Team second. First shot good. Winnemack gonna send Croft in. Smith with one foul left to give. Have to imagine coach might hold her until the fourth. Second shot up and good. Harness getting to the hard way. Croft, cross midcourt. She's going to drive over to the left. Passes to Aubrey Gearhart. Gearhart to Ella Gearhart. And the arms of Croft. Campbell for three. Off the mark. Lady Comets getting that rebound. They send it to Klingler at the post. Shot rattles around. It's no good. Comets rebound. Follow up shot by Molenkoff. No good. Foul there on Zimpleman. That's her second, team third. Klingler getting a break. Lane Oliver back in. Ball in the hands of Ella Gearhart. And we're going to have a foul called here on Lane Oliver. Her third, team fourth. You can see the frustration on Lane Oliver's face. That was obviously not any kind of an intentional foul. Comets really putting some tight pressure on there, nearly forcing a turnover. Ball over to Croft. Foul going to be called on Isabel Scales now. Her first, team fifth. Inbound, swatted out of bounds by Lane Oliver. Running some time off the clock here. 37 seconds left in the third quarter.
Allie Gearhart looking to inbound it. Inbound to Croft. Croft goes baseline. Ball out of bounds off of Isabel Scales. 35 seconds left to play here in the third. Long inbound to Villanueva. Into the, she sends it in the paint. Pass picked off, and we're going to have a jump ball here. Possession stays with Winnemac. Deep inbound to Villanueva. Villanueva looking for some help. Sends it over to Croft. Croft for three. Shot off the mark. Put back attempt made by Aubrey Gearhart. She couldn't quite get that uh get that going. Three pointer by Croft off the mark. Comets with that rebound. 15 seconds left in the quarter. Going to give it to Izzy Scales. Over to Zimpleman. Scales. Zimpleman, six seconds to play. Over to Oliver, who gets shut down on that shot attempt. At the end of three, Caston 36. Winnemac 24. Eight more minutes of regulation here. Looking forward to seeing what the basketball game looks like in the last eight minutes. You're watching Comets Warriors Basketball here on RTC TV4. Wade is taking the hardwood for the last eight minutes here tonight. Or at least the last eight minutes of regulation. Comets will kick this fourth quarter off. Ball in play to Isabel Scales. Scales of the volleyball line. Villanueva waiting at the top of the key. Ball just pulled out of the hands of Bailey Harness. And Croft will put it in for two. Scales cross midcourt. Taking her time, looking to set up the play. Dishes it down to Zimpleman at the post. Shot no good. Life got a little rough looking for that rebound. Swatted out of bounds by... Winnemac, Molenkoff into Zimpleman. Zimpleman around the top of the key, back to Molenkoff. Down to Harness at the post, shot no good. Put back by Klingler, no good. Croft sends it to Gearhart, back out to Croft. Croft for three, shot no good. And we'll have a jump ball. Possession arrow, Winnemac. Inbound attempt, swatted back out by Klingler. Ball into Villanueva. Into the paint and by, shot by Gearhart, no good. Comets rebound. And out of bounds at the other end of the floor. Let's 
Smith into Campbell. Campbell breaking left, passes off to Ella Gearhart. Gearhart to Villanueva, over to Campbell. Down to the post to Gearhart, back out to Campbell. Campbell picks up her dribble, cross court to Croft. Croft with an open three and it's good. Scales across the timeline. Out to Zimpleman. Zimpleman for three. Off the mark. And we'll have a Winamag rebound here. Campbell to Croft. Croft will drive into the paint. Sends it across to Smith. Smith tries to pass to... Uh, Campbell picked off by Zempelman, or not Zempelman, Harness. She drives in, takes the shot, draws the foul. She'll go to the line. Foul here on number three, Kingsley Croft. Her third, team third. Harness to the line for two. First shot good. Aubrey Gearhart back in for Winnemac. Second shot rattles in and out for Harness. Winnemac rebound. Campbell passes to Gearhart. Gearhart into the paint. Tries to pass it to Aubrey Gearhart. Picked off by Scales. Scales goes, attempts to go coast to coast. Can't transition vertical. And she will uh, just run it out of bounds. Maya Campbell bringing the ball down the court. Five and a half minutes remain. Zimpleman at the volleyball line waiting. Pass off to Aubrey Gearhart. Smith, Smith was open, didn't take the shot. Passes it to Ella Gearhart. Ball out of bounds off of Winnemac. Winnemac crowd not happy about that call. Ball into Scales. Scales at the volleyball line. Over to Zimpleman. Zimpleman across the volleyball line to Mollenkoff. Over Scales. Scales for three. Too hard. Winamac rebound. Aubrey Gearhart drives in the paint. Goes back out to Campbell for three. Off the mark. And Harness gets that rebound. Oh, and we're going to have a charge at the other end called on Klingler. Her second, team six. Coach Douglas not real happy with that call, but you just got to keep playing. Campbell up to the – up to uh, – Center court where Zimpleman was waiting. We'll have a jump ball down here. Caster will get possession. Four and a half minutes left in regulation. And we'll have a casting timeout. Four and a half minutes left to play. Caston 37, Winnemac 29. You're watching. Comets basketball here on RTC TV4.
The Lady Comets taking possession. Pressure being put on by the Lady Warriors now. Molenkoff to Zimpleman. Zimpleman nearly losing control of it, manages to keep it, getting pressed back to the half court line. Takes advantage of a pick over to Molenkoff. Molenkoff baseline, passes down to Klingler, puts it in for two. Campbell across the timeline, Zimpleman's waiting for her. Over to Smith, Smith with an open three point look, off the mark, gets her own rebound. Foul called on number five, Maggie Smith. That'll be her fifth. Oh, and the Winnemac coach gets teched up arguing with the ref. Winnemac coach unhappy, says that they had control of the ball when that foul was called. Bailey Harness will go to the line for two, uncontested. Well, first shot a little hard off the back of the rim. Second shot off the front of the rim. Overcompensated the amount of power. Comets getting possession at the half court line. 3.49 left in regulation. 10 point common advantage. Scales in the center circle. Goes to the right. Bad pass gets picked off. Campbell behind the back and over to Croft. Croft drives down to the baseline. Puts it up under contention. And we'll have a foul called here, I believe, on Isabel Scales. Foul is on Scales, her second. Team seventh. Aubrey Gearhart at the line for two. First shot off the mark. Second shot off the front of the rim. Warriors with the rebound but goes out of bounds. Warriors now putting on a full court press. 319 to play, 10 minute. Deficit for the Warriors. Comets moving the ball well, trying to break this press. Pass to Klingler's back. Luckily, Addison Zimpleman there to save the day. In double coverage. Ref's going to call a jump ball. Warriors will get possession. Campbell working her way across midcourt. Top of the key, jumper from the paint, off the mark, and Comets get that rebound. Ball into Klingler. Klingler will dribble a couple times, tries to pass it back to Molenkoff, too high. Warriors will get the ball back in their territory. 2.46 left on the clock. Ball into Campbell. Croft with a relatively wide open three off the mark. Heavy pressure against Scales. 
drives hard down the side and draws the foul down at Comet's baseline. Foul on number 10, Ella Gearhart, her second. Team sixth. 2.33 left on the clock. Molenkoff into the baseline to Klingler, shots off the mark. Warriors rebound. Campbell to Croft. Croft for three. Paul gets wedged. Sends the ball into Gearhart. Over to Villanueva. Down to the post. To Campbell, who puts it in for two. Timeout called. 2.15 to play. Kasten 39. Winnemac 31. They've got that lead down to eight. Molenkoff to look looking to inbound against some serious Winamac pressure here. Into Zimpleman. Zimpleman nearly loses control of the ball. Stuck at the baseline. Ball ripped right out of her hands. Jump ball. Gives possession back to the Comets. Just over two minutes to play. Scales gets wrapped up with Molenkoff and gets fouled. Foul on number three, Kingsley Croft. It'll be her fourth, team seventh. And there's that missing foul I couldn't find from the first half. That was Kingsley Croft's fifth. She'll sit down for the last two minutes and four seconds of play. Scales at the line for one and one. First shot good. Second shot, also good. Scales bringing the Comets back to a 10-point lead. Two minutes left to play. Zimpleman waiting for Campbell. Campbell into the paint. We're gonna send it over to Aubrey Gearhart and nearly takes it out of bounds. Tight defense being played by the Comets. Campbell goes all the way around the arc. Ball to Villanueva, back to Campbell. Over to Aubrey Gearhart. Gearhart goes to the right, gets trapped, jump ball. Warriors retain possession. 123 left on the clock. And Winnemac will call a timeout here. Full timeout. We've got a 123 left to play here where the Comets are enjoying a 10 point lead. Stay tuned. You're watching Comets Warriors basketball on RTC TV4.
right. Warriors with possession. Under 90 seconds left to play here tonight. Gearhart sends the ball into Villanueva. Over to Aubrey Gearhart. Back to Campbell. Campbell for three. Shots off the mark. And Comets with that rebound. Ball turned back over. Foul on Isabel Scales, her third. Team eight. Aubrey Gearhart at the line for two. Shot off the mark. Out of bounds off the Comets. Ball into Aubrey Gearhart. Over to Villanueva. Attempt to pass into the paint. No good. Comets with that ball. Molenkoff to Scales. Trying to get across the timeline. Under a minute left to play. Scales in the center circle. Over to Molenkoff. Back to Scales. Back to Molenkoff. And Molenkoff will get fouled by Gearhart. Gearhart second, team eighth. Molenkoff of the line for one and one. Shots off the mark. Warriors get that rebound. Ball out of bounds off the Warriors. Comets will get it back. 36 seconds left on the clock. Ball into the back court. Scales at the center circle. Sends it over to Harness. Harness to Molenkoff. Run time off the clock. Ball picked away. Villanueva goes up and gets swatted. Harness back to Scales, 10 seconds on the clock. Scales in double coverage, looking for the pass. Passes to Klingler at the buzzer, and that is a Lady Comets victory here tonight. Your final score, Cast and Comets 41, Winnemac Warriors 31. We're going to say thank you to our sponsors here this evening. I'll be right back with some uh, post-game stats. This was Comets and Warriors basketball here on RTC TV4.